Here's what you missed on Fathead and Candy in the morning. Weekdays, 6 to 10 a.m. on My Country 96.1. It's the bald and the beautiful. Everything from Nashville to Hollywood on My Country 96.1. All right, Candy, we start with the high women in country music. That's Marin Morris, Brandy Carlisle, and their group of four. You know, they have some music out. Oh, yeah. Uh, there's a song called Crowded Table, which is now the song of the Campbell Soup commercial, talking about how one day we'll be back at a crowded table. So I hope so. Yeah. The uh, Dixie Chicks album postponed. Uh, their new song uh, not received uh, so well, and they're oh. po- postponing the album uh, indefinitely. We'll see what happens there. Um, Candy, I told you earlier in the show about a new term, which I know you don't follow because you're not really on the Internet. And this is a good thing, a good reason not to be. Go ahead. Well, uh, Chris and Andrew Cuomo are quite the chatter uh, amongst the uh, folks on the Internet. And there's a new term for people who like them called Cuomosexuals, Candy. I mean, that's beyond, okay? It's a big deal. It's new, new. If one of them shows up as the sexiest man on the cover of People, I'm going to protest. Governor Cuomo may, Candy. He's got a shot. It's possible. Uh, Uh, Will Smith is going to air an interview he did with Dr. Fauci on his uh, website or podcast or whatever he's got going on, uh, talking about how COVID-19 is hitting African-American communities and other different minority communities pretty hard, and in some cases harder, uh, the hardest uh, around the country. So um, that'll be an interesting interview. Looking forward to that. I, doctor, I like Dr. Fauci. Are you a Dr. Fauci believer? I do like him. I feel bad for him sometimes, but yeah, he's got a tough, uh, tough gig over there. Yeah, Demi Lovato donating and starting a new mental health fund uh, around this time, uh, helping people who need the help with everything going on. Uh, plasma donations. George Stephanopoulos, Tom Hanks, Rita Wilson, among others, who are giving their plasma, which is very important if you have gotten over coronavirus, Candy. Uh, yes, very you know, important. It, it is. And I know a guy, his name is Stokes. He's in the Nashville community. He's a record guy. He's a uh, producer. Um, and Stokes got coronavirus he called me and he told me that he is on the front lines in tennessee talking about plasma donation so oh, wow very very important this could uh, be the trick i hope so script spelling bee canceled for the first time since 1945 candy wow that's yeah that's big well, at least my kids can now feel better about themselves. They don't have to watch those kids. Oh, you're one of those people. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> I you actually, should all be mediocre. On the contrary, you know I want my kids to strive for excellence. I am yes. kidding. Uh, Gronk going to play with Brady and the Bucks. How you feel he about needs that? His, I, I think he needs his head examined. He was yeah. doing so well, and the, there was going to be a lot going on for him. And now he's back to football where he could get gravely hurt. I don't like no. it at all. And he's had a lot of concussions. Uh, Michael Jordan getting three to four million for that Last Dance documentary on ESPN. He's donating it all to charity. Candy? Oh, very nice. People magazine cover most beautiful people issue will feature three generations. Goldie Hawn, Kate Hudson, and her daughter, Ronnie. Very nice. That's very cute. Uh, my father uh, was not happy that we passed Queen Elizabeth's birth, uh, Queen birthday yesterday. Queen was not confused either. Yeah, my father loves Queen Elizabeth. We did not discuss her birthday yesterday. And now I see an article, so I better mention it, that someone breaks in the Queen's shoes. She doesn't have to even break in her own shoes, Candy. Oh, my. Well, I heard they were going to have a Zoom party. Who's that? The Queen! Get out of here. I heard yesterday they were going to celebrate the Queen's birthday on Zoom. So she is able to work the internet better than you. That is crazy. Well, I'm sure she has an assistant that does mm. it all for her and then says, Ma'am, please sit down, Your Highness, mm. and curtsies and leaves the room. Possibly. May 15th, the new Scooby-Doo movie going straight to On Demand. And the Hunger Games prequel movies in the works. The new book comes out May 19th. It's a prequel to all the Hunger Games. We'll focus on the origin of President Snow. Candy? I'm in. I'm in. You like that. Okay. Oh, yeah. Uh, Leah in sixth grade right now is reading uh, Hunger Games. Oh, yeah. Casey, my son, turned me on to the movies. I loved it. Yeah, they're great. Uh, TV mess singer on Fox, a millionaire who wants to be a millionaire, ABC, and Netflix new show called Win the Wilderness, where six couples battle in the wild and the ultimate winner gets a cabin home in Alaska, Candy. 
That's nice, but the only thing to watch tonight is Jersey on Jersey. Right, and that is, you say, on regular television? Yes, and it is Bruce Springsteen, John Bon Jovi, Whoopi Goldberg, Danny DeVito, a bunch of people. All right, good stuff. We can search yeah. that out. Uh, there's your Bald and the Beautiful, everything from Nashville to Hollywood. Fathead and Candy in the morning, weekdays 6 to 10 a.m. on My Country 96.1.